Hi everyone, and welcome to my video on Sidereals in Akan. My goal for this one is that anyone that watches it can confidently do Raid Lead in Akan after watching it. Some of the Sidereals are pretty much fixed, but there is definitely some room for Sidereal variety in this raid. I will do my best to provide you with options that would work in almost any scenario, and give you my own preferences and thoughts on some of the different options as well. Let's get to it. Akan gate 2. So for this gate I'm going to present you with two routes. One is the more safer and comfortable option and the second one is the special sidereal interaction. Let's start with the first one. First sidereal, you inanna during the red circles at 144 mech. This cleanses everyone's gauge and allows you to do a lot of damage for the duration of the mech. Second Sidereal. You can Inanna a second time if you have it up before the 55 bar hot potato mech. Often this will be during the 84 bar red circles. You can even throw it during the 55 bar mech if many have high gauge. As that mech resolves you will regain a lot of Sidereal gauge which is why you want to use it before this mech and not after. You can also use Thyrain before 55 bars if you have really low DPS or multiple people dead. For your last Sidereals of this gate, you Thyrain Akan for tons of destruction points during his last stand. As a leader, pay close attention to the Sidereal meter during this phase as it will fill completely with 3 successful counters. During this phase you will throw 1-3 to three Thyrains, depending on your party's destruction. Special Sidereal Interaction Options You use your first Sidereal as a Khan appears to do the instant death swipe at 84 bar. You use Tyrain, and this is only recommended in high damage groups where there is no need to lower gauge because the fight is over so quickly. It's pretty cool, but I prefer Inanna even in my overgate runs. With this method, you won't get another Sidereal before the end phase. And the last phase is the same as the one I described previously. You just use Tyrain for tons of destruction points during his last stand. Thank you so much for watching, if you made it all the way to the end, props to you. 
I can already tell you get what it takes to lead raids in a con. If you found it helpful, please consider leaving a like or subscribing. That way I can justify spending more time on videos like this one. Until next time, see ya!